Limhi and his people had sent their own scouts out, hoping to find Zarahemla, and they looked and looked, and then they found this land. They thought was Zarahemla, That they right? thought was Zarahemla, it's totally destroyed. Oh, wow. Right? And they thought we're alone in the world, where, where the last one's help is not coming. Yeah. Right. And so then in chapter eight, after Limhi has realized, wait a second, if Ammon and these other scouts are from Zarahemla, what did we find? Right. And their scouts had brought back some records from there and they're in a script that nobody knows and nobody can read. So if we go to chapter eight, Starting at verse 12, okay. we can read a little bit about that situation. Uh, and this is Limhi going, And I say unto thee again, knowest thou of anyone that can translate? For I am desirous that these records should be translated into our language, for perhaps they will give us a knowledge of a remnant of the people who have been destroyed from whence these records came. Or perhaps they will give us a knowledge of this very people who have been destroyed and I am desirous to know the cause of their destruction. So Limhi and his people, having been warned by prophets, the consequences were gonna come, they were on a path to destruction, and having experienced the beginning of those consequences, they're really interested in these prophetic patterns of what happens, what do you do, how can you know? And so that's why they, they wanna find another prophet, but of course, the prophet who had come to them, they'd killed. 